Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be like a little recap of my first week of college at the University of Virginia. For those of you who have never seen my face, I am Jordan Alexandria. I am a first year at the University of Virginia. I am staying home this college semester. And yeah, I am a engineering major. I'm majoring aerospace and mechanical engineering. We haven't declared it yet, but that's what I intend to major in. If you want to see this quick recap of my week, just keep on watching. Okay, so let me go ahead and pull up my schedule, y'all, because I'm gonna spill the tea. Because I'm tired. My brain cells are already thinning out, like, it's actually kind of sad. Let's make love in the summertime. Okay, so I'm gonna start this video by just like telling you guys what class I'm taking because I've never really came on camera and said that. So I am taking a MSc class, which is Material Science and Engineering. I am taking APMA, which is a Calc 1 class. I'm retaking Calc. That should just tell you how bad my AP scores were. And then I am taking a chemistry class, Chem 1410, and I'm also taking Chem Lab. 14 11. We're gonna talk about those two classes in like the next clip. But yes, I'm also taking an intro to engineering class, which is engineer 1624. And that's it, right? Yeah, that's it. So those are the classes I'm taking this semester. I'm taking five classes, which is worth 15 credit hours. So can we say tired already? <laughs> Okay, we started school on August 25th, which was a Tuesday. So I was all hype prep, all of that stuff. All of my classes, I love them. But it's just, you know, it's downloading software that I have to pay for out of my pocket. And buying books. Mm. When I tell y'all free PDFs from to be your friend, because I have found three books i think as pdfs i've only had to buy one book and i'm gonna have to buy my apma book because we have to first of all we have to pay for the website the online website that we're using which is called web design web design and um the book comes with that and it's 120 dollars um i had to pay for my chemistry book and the access to that website which was 90 and that's 90 for only for the book and only like this semester access to the website because like for engineering i only have to take one semester of chemistry so it's like i'm only paying for one semester i'm not you're not charging my car 200 for full school year plus the book no no that's not gonna happen but yes yeah, so i am taking chemistry 1410 and chemistry 1411 chemistry 1411 is the lab they do not depend on each other at all you can literally take one in the fall and one in the spring one in the fall and take one freaking next school year like you can literally split it up it does not matter because they do not pin on each other but i didn't know that so i thought that chemistry 1410 and chemistry 1411 went together and i was like okay you guys enrolled me in these two classes so i'm just gonna take both of them mistakes have been made like i just feel like i have had so much work to do for chemistry already that when I go to my chemistry lab tomorrow, because today is Sunday, so when I go to my chemistry lab tomorrow, I'm probably going to be looking crazy. Like, I can, I can already feel it. As far as, like, me liking a class and stuff like that, I, first of all, my MSc class, love it. Like, the professor, he's really cool, really just a down-to-earth person. He's really nice. Like, we don't really talk in a class. He just teaches, and then we just all, you know, skedaddle when he says, okay, see you on Thursday. So, that's usually how it goes, and he's really... He's really chill and the teacher, the TA is really nice as well. But I want to just talk about the workload a little bit because I wasn't really prepared for it. I went to a charter school, a small charter school in the suburbs. And if you got, if you know who I am, you know what school I went to, you probably went to my school. And uh, especially if you went AP classes, especially if you were in three AP classes for the last two years, you understand how much work we got especially if you were in AP Bio. I was in that class for like three seconds, not even a lie, and I left because it was so much work. But you all know how much work we got. And I can say that it seems like the classes I'm taking, I'm getting more work than that. But I'm liking college, Um, even though like I'm not physically on a campus, I'm really enjoying the freedom I have. 
that's crazy to say even though I'm at home like I really enjoy having classes having one class a day like having a class I literally have one class on Friday and it ends at 9 50 a.m come on now so I really like just the the schedule like how they um are just planned out I guess the one thing that I will say is like it's kind of hard to keep up with a lot of different things like this first week especially if all your professors are using a different platform to communicate with you on like teams freaking grades like everybody's using something different like the one thing they have in common is they're using this one website collab and it's like easier to like communicate with that but it's like people have still a bit under resources some people have a whole different they have like important information under resources they have announcements and stuff like that it's kind of hard to keep up with it was a little overwhelming i should say this first week but like today i'm taking the time out after i record this video i'm taking the time out to go through and see what's due this week and writing it on my calendar um i also have some work i need to do today but yeah this video was just like to give you guys a little quick update about um how i feel about my after my first week of classes and yeah that's basically it for this video stay tuned because in the next couple weeks either this this week or next week I will be filming a week in my life video and you all will see the real life struggles of Jordan Alexandria because whoo the brain cells are thinning they're stretching they're spreading themselves thin here and the uh, y'all needs to see <laughs> I'll be struggling but we're all in this together you know college is college and we're just gonna keep pushing and keep chugging along because guess what we have a degree to get no one or nothing is coming in between me and my mechanical and aerospace engineering degree but i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know down below what you guys thought make sure you leave a like and a comment make sure you guys turn on your post notifications because if you haven't already why are you playing around come on just just join the fam like just join the fam you know stay tuned for next week's video and i'll see you guys later bye